Hey guys, yeah, what's going on? Freeze Fire Films here, and uh, today I'm Tyler here with uh, another uh, mod review, and this is also the Statues mod. Uh, I recently uploaded one, and, um, hold on, and, um, then there was an update for it, and it wasn't much of an update, but I wanted to do it, plus, um, there, I can also show you the uh, crafting recipes today. So, uh, first off, uh, the new block it adds is this block, but, uh, Anyway, I'm going to start with the crafting recipes, and, um, so let's go to the crafting table, and I finally found out what the mysterious powder does, that's what allows you to craft all this stuff, what is this? Giant statue generator. I wonder what this is. Name of the player skin that will be used. 15, I don't know what this is, but... Oh, whoa, that's awesome. And then I guess I'll use my skin. Anyway, what block is this? Clay? That's just clay. Okay. Anyway, that's awesome there. Anyway, let's, um, I should really decorate that with my skin. My skin. Anyway, let's get into the mod review. So, first up, let me open up the forms here. We'll need. Hold on, we're, we're gonna need some stone, which is here, and we're gonna need some stone slabs. <coughs> Alright, so now in order to craft a statue, place stone in that pattern, and then stone slabs in that pattern, and put a mysterious powder right in the middle. This will create a statue. Um, so now I'm gonna need, I'm not really prepared, but that's okay. We're gonna need sticks, and we're gonna need, get out of here, stupid fly. There's a fly flying around and it's landing on me. I'm gonna need some iron. Get! I'll kill you. <laughs> so next up, we have the um <clears throat> the hammer. Stop! You freaking fly! That thing's so annoying. It keeps it keeps landing on me. So we'll put it in this pattern, and there you go. So that'll create the hammer for you. And they don't stack, I guess. No, they don't stack. Now, in order to create the chisel, it's just like that. Pretty simple. Alright. So that that was pretty easy. And, um, what's next? Alright, now to create the mysterious powder itself, you're going to need a bunch of blocks. Um, so, sand, wood, wood planks. So, sand, wood, Wooden planks, um, cobble, dirt, stone, gravel, cobble, dirt, stone, gravel, cobble, stone, dirt, gravel, which is somewhere, gravel, um, diamond, and coal. Alright, now you gotta arrange these in a pattern, and Oh boy, I don't know how this goes. So, sand, wood, wooden plank, diamond, coal, um, cobble, dirt, uh, stone, and gravel. Perfect! So that'll give you nine mysterious powder. Alright. So, finally we have the, um, Showcase. And this was the update. One of the things that it up that it added. Um, so in in order to create the showcase thing, you'll need two sticks, um, two wood, three glass panes, and mysterious powder. All right. So it'll be in this pattern. Glass panes on the very top. Wood there. Sticks here and mysterious powder there. Alright, so that'll give you a showcase. Now what you can do with the showcase is you place it down and then it's it's rather big, it's two blocks. No, one, two, three blocks, jeez. And uh, you just right click on it and there is a animation for it, so that's cool. And now when you open it you can put I uh, probably anything in there. Yeah, if it doesn't work then it'll just be like really small. However, if it does work, it'll be laying down, like that. Um, 
So you can probably put a stick in here. And it'll be laying down. So it works with it. So I don't think it'll work with that. Yeah. So if it doesn't work, then I'll just kind of stand and be rather small. But if it does work, then it'll be laying down. So this is kind of cool for at home. Maybe like, like you made your first diamond sword or your first diamond and you want to display it proudly. So you go, you just put it right in there. So, um, yeah, there you have it. And there's, uh, besides this, there's another thing here. Um, when you open up this now, when you clicked on Steve, it would be this. It would be basic. But now, they added one called basic, and it'll be, it be the black and white Steve. Now when you actually click Steve, it'll be the original Steve. However, I'm using a texture pack, so now it'll actually work. So when I do my texture pack reviews, I can show you what Steve would look like. So, um, thank you, my creator, for adding that. It'll help me out. And, uh, everything else is, is uh, just still the same. I can still do the skin for 1998. And, um, yeah. So, um, that's about it for today, guys. There's, uh, Statues Mod Review, part two, I guess you could say. And, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, I'm gonna decorate this, and, um, I'll be right back when I'm done. Alright guys, I'm back, and, uh, I didn't get too technical here. Uh, there isn't a peach or tan or anything, so I didn't do the skin, I slept the clay, and, uh, I didn't, I didn't want to feel like doing all that special detail that I had with my shirt. So, like, all those different variations of colors there. So I just made it all red. But, uh, yeah, so, um... There's your mod review for the day. There's your uh, Clay Soldiers mod. And uh, if you enjoyed, uh, you know what to do if you enjoyed. And, um, yeah, so I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and, uh, yeah. Tell me what mod I should do next. Cause if not, uh, I know what mod I'm going to do next. And it's pretty cool. So, um, yeah. This mod is um, something that it doesn't necessarily add things that you need. Or that make your, um life easier in Minecraft, it's just something that, well, it's just something that, um, I enjoy having, so, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.